take this. It'll help loosen his tongue. But be careful. He's a tricky little bastard. If he figures out who sent you, he'll tell you nothing. I'll be listening to every word you say. Well, that's a lot of pressure. Oh, I ask for brawn, they send me a handmaiden. Well, you're here. You might as well come in. Let me guess. Your family is in grave danger. And you've come seeking my help? Not that I'd be of much use to you. As you can see, I'm at a bit of a disadvantage. I brought you a gift. Wine. You know the way to my heart. And you didn't even have to hide it. Hmm. Doesn't smell poisoned. Poisoned? Cersei would love nothing more than to save herself the trouble of a trial. You don't expect me to drink alone, do you? They never let anyone in to see me. I suppose I'll have just a little. Ah, true girl of the North. Hmm. Some things are worth dying for. So, why are you here? It's rather unusual for a handmaiden to visit the Black Cells. Lady Marjorie sent me. Did she? With wine from Cersei's cellar. How generous of her. I have to admit, I've always admired your honesty. But I suspect there's more to you than one might imagine. This is all a ruse, isn't it? Sorry? You're coming here. We both know you have an ulterior motive. You already know the motive, though. Family. You've come to set me free. It's the perfect plan. No one would suspect it of you. <laughs> you found me out. How did you know? You can learn a great deal about someone if you're paying attention. So, tell me. Cersei sent you, didn't she? I know I'm not wrong. The truth, Mira. Are you toying with me? I might ask you the same question. Now tell me the truth. Admit it. I don't know what you're talking about. She did no such thing. The guards have never let anyone in with wine. That was your first mistake. Not that I don't appreciate the gesture. I wish you'd had the courage okay. to tell me the truth. Not that I'm above drinking her wine. I told you to be careful. You'll twist your words. Stupid girl. You're acting a fool. I owe him the truth. Him? He's nothing now. I'm still a Lannister. And I know plenty of men who'd happily slit your throat. Now, give us a moment. We're not done talking. Imp. What did my sister expect you would learn? Who will testify on your behalf? She's using you. And will continue to do so. Until you no longer prove useful. I'm the one using her. <laughs> if that's what you think, then you're more foolish than I thought. She's taking care of a problem for me. Cersei is not someone to be trifled with. And what would Lady Marjorie make of your new friendship with my sister? I doubt she'd be pleased. Assuming she doesn't dismiss you immediately. Lady Marjorie doesn't know. And I intend to keep it that way. You're fooling yourself if you think it's your secret to keep. And without her protection, you're in a very precarious position. <clears throat> what should I tell Cersei? You're a clever girl. I'm sure you'll think of something. Although I would suggest you choose your words carefully. Cersei would be far less amused if she catches you in a lie. I have to give her a list of names. Tell her I'll call Shagger, son of Dolph from the Mountain Clans. Oh, and Timid, and Chella. 
and the, the scepter who raised me, assuming she's still alive. Enough of this nonsense! You're wasting my time! Out! Now! I wish you well, Lady Mira. Be careful who you trust. Yeah, that didn't really go as a plan. I'm guessing some time has passed because he's looking reasonably oh god oh, maybe leave? not that much time. There's his cane and there's Sorry. his naked wench. Didn't mean to wake you. Oh, you didn't sleep, did you? Neither did you. We haven't slept much at all these last few weeks. Alright, it's been a few weeks. Okay. I, I hope you don't have any regrets. About this. About us. I've, I've never felt much. more certain about anything. I'm glad. I wasn't sure if you... With all that's happened. What will we do now? Now that we're... Uh, what we are. We'll be married. And no one will be able to keep us apart. Not Griff. Not his father. Not Ramsay Snow. I was hoping you'd say that. Roderick? Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were alone. Good morning, Talia. Hello, Elena. Oh, I, I didn't realize you two were... It's all right, Talia. Come in. I really am sorry. It's just, this is urgent, Roderick. And... It's, it's all right. I can go. You two need to speak. It's off. Slink off. I'll see you soon. I hope. Scars are looking wicked. All right then. I'm listening. Last night I couldn't. I was having nightmares, so I. Go on, Talia. I went back there to the grove and someone was there what do you mean look this is a report how many fighting men we have yeah that's Where spy Griff and the white hill garrison are being held they even talks about elena when you were had you I know. Knew we had a spy it's everything you just I didn't do anything it. It about it. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. You said you saw someone. Who? Someone we trusted. Who? Tell me, I need to know who it was. He's like family, Roderick. But it doesn't matter. Who? He's a traitor. He endangered our house. You have to deal with him like you would any other man. I'm sure he had his reasons. But no reason is good enough. It's your duty to tell me. And mine to pass judgment. Just promise me you'll kill him, Roderick. No. Anyone who would betray us like this deserves to die. I'm asking you as your sister. I'm lord of this house, Talia. It's my job to deliver justice, not vengeance. I can't promise to kill a man before I've heard him out. You know what he's done. That should be enough. Talia, please. Come with me. He's in the Great Hall. Okay. Oh god, I hope it's not the Sentinel. Is there going to be a bunch of people in the Great Hall or just one person? Is it the Maester? Maesters are supposed to be pretty independent. Like, even if the house fell, the Maester would be alright. Oh, the reveal. Go get the guards. Wouldn't need guards if it was the maester. Sir Royland. The Sentinel. Or is it Duncan? Oh. My lord. It's Duncan. <laughs> you scared me after. It's 
So you know. Yes, I know. I didn't mean for you to learn this way. Start explaining yourself, Duncan. What do you want me to say? What I did. I did for your own good. For House Forrester. For your father's legacy. You told them everything, Duncan. Our plans, our strategies. I only told them enough to keep us from war. But why? Because you're reckless, Roderick. Just as Ethan was. Choosing that warmonger Royland as his sentinel. Ethan was a boy. But you're not. And you've been in danger in this house since the day you got home. Refusing to kiss Lud's ring, even though you knew he'd retaliate. Losing your betrothal to Elena. It doesn't matter how either of you feel. Lord Glenmore will never let you marry her now. And now, getting Arthur killed. Enough, Duncan! You're not a leader. You're a wounded soldier trying to prove he's still a man. I'm actually trying to save this family. Everything I've done, I've done for them. Hate me for it, but it's the bloody truth. And the North Grove, did you tell them about that too? No, they've never even heard the name. I've kept the secrets that mattered. The only thing that matters is that you swore an oath to obey me. And you broke it. I swore to obey your father. He commanded respect. All you command is violence. This house is doomed with you in charge. Oh, and you know it. Hurts me to say that. But I wish you'd never crawled off that corpse cart. You're a traitor, Duncan! Nothing you say will change that. I know what I did was right. No, it wasn't. That's not the guards. How could you? My lord, Griff's gone. Someone helped him escape. Was this your doing? Lud was going to ambush you at the exchange. I did it to save your life. But Ryan, Duncan, I trusted you. Let's just get this over with. What do you want me to do with him, my lord? Kill me, and I won't be able to help you save Asher. He's in danger, Roderick. <gasps> no, he's what not. What do you mean? I know Lud's plans. Spare my life, and I'll tell you everything. Please, Roderick. Perhaps we should hear him out. I'll spare your life. Now talk. Mira cost Lud his army. He's desperate to strike back. He's going to ambush Asher the moment he makes landfall. No! Take this traitor away. <clears throat> Silencing me won't change things. You're making a mistake. I'm still the lord of this Duncan house, though. Said. We have to warn Asher. How? We can't, not if he's at sea. My lord, what do we do? Staring at the flames until the problems deal with themselves. Prepare the horses. We ride for the coast. Smell the putrid land. Come on, break it up! Save your love making for below deck. They listen to you. Barely. But what Not happens if your lord brother decides he's the one in charge once we're at Ironrath? Do you expect them to follow his orders? Or will it be you commanding them? They don't know him. A lord sounds an awful lot like a master. I'm just another sword. No different than any of you. Roderick is the rightful lord. Trust me, everyone will love him. They'll want to fight for him. Hey, if he's anything like you, 
Well, well no, he's not. He's not anything like me. There ain't no one like me. All right, so we better get shafted. That's odd. Port's quiet. No guards. Hardly any ships. Maybe they're all off fighting one of your king's wars. No. Could be. Or could be we'll have a fight on our hands. Probably. I'll let the others know. Right. How experienced is Lud's army going to be, oh, though? He's just a hold fast. Easy, Whereas these guys are all experienced warriors, especially Dasher and Beshka. They're both experienced fighters. So, this is Westeros. Yep. Ugly. Beautiful. And small. Fucking freezing, too. I said you'd be paid. I never said you'd be warm. Yeah, you probably should have brought some clothes. Well, shit. Asher. Thank the gods you've made it back. You've looked better. We've no time for small talk, brother. Hope you're ready for a fight. Lord knows you're coming. He sent men to intercept you. We need to hurry. Been stuck on a boat for weeks. Can use a good fight. What? All right. Buster after. Get that gate open. Asha, no. I don't think even the beast could open that. It's been a while since I killed any white hills. Fuck, beasts angry. Out of my way. It won't go farther. Oh, fuck, the beast. Asha, you have to get out of there. Looks like it's up to us. Well, Asha. Ten minutes off the boat, and he's already wounded. The gate. Oh, Alright, so I'm at the queue. Is that it? Ah, we are fucked. The gate will fall without one of us holding it. One of us has to stay. Who stays behind? Oh, fuck me. This is... No, <laughs> I'm not making this choice. Fuck. Who stays behind? Alright, I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna overthink it. I'm just gonna go... with gut instinct. On, uh, yeah. My lord, you must hurry! Let me save your life, and our house. Iron from ice, brother. Iron from ice. I just went with me gut. I couldn't I'll overthink it. But my lord, you Asher can't. is your new lord. Yes, my lord. Rodrick, go! Take as many of them as you can with you! Anyone else? Is that it? Is that all I'm getting? This guy. Well, he'll have a headache, but I don't think uh, I don't think I've taken him out. Oh, there we go. He's taken out. Right? 
there any point hammer in the queue? I'm just going to get stabbed repeatedly, aren't I? Was that the right decision? I couldn't I couldn't have overthought it. I just had to go with what I felt was right. So <laughs> fuck. You and seventy percent did not try to stab Ramsey Snow. You and sixty five percent spared Blood Song. Uh, you and sixty one percent did not tell Tyrion that Cersei sent you. You and forty seven percent chose to imprison the traitor. And you and fifty one percent had Roderick stay behind. I'm surprised that's such an even split. I guess it all just comes down to what you how you feel so is this going to be next time on no straight to credits slam to black after such an emotional ending i'm not surprised thanks very much for watching everybody i hope you've enjoyed the last uh, few episodes this was a short one but my god was it a fucking heart-wrenching one hopefully it'll be a bit quicker than two months until the next episode's out and we'll find out how all of this shitstorm ends Thanks very much for watching, guys, and I'll catch you next time.